deck, it's been a frustrating number of weeks for you being out injured. Yeah, yeah, it's obviously been a long, long old road that's been mentally challenging. Um, something, my first kind of proper long term injury. Um, I'm 29, so luckily, kind of, you could look at it. Luckily, um, in terms of that, there's a lot of boys that struggle with injury throughout their career, but. I got to 29 before my long, my first long term one, but uh, yeah, it was it was a long old journey um, and kind of frustrating one. But I got obviously the last three four weeks, I've, I've managed to get some really good training in me and back running and get build up a kind of fitness um, again. And today just obviously went. You couldn't ask for any better, really. Um, for, a, for a return but uh, no, it's just thanks to everybody around me in terms of the staff and um, obviously Phil the physio and stuff that's, that's helped me through um, the gaffer and Sarge as well and, and, and the players that have, have kept me sane throughout um, and yourself um, yeah it's, it's been long and long and hard but I, I got there well, we talk about your most weeks in the press conference with Craig Harrison. We've been getting updates as you've been progressing through your comeback. And he did say during the week that you would be involved in some way this weekend. Yeah. You were on the bench. Did that come as a surprise to you? Or did you feel that was just about the right time to get back into things? Um, I think, I think the, the plan probably would have been next week. Um, but I've I done pretty well during during training this week in, in terms of how my body reacted and um, I gradually felt better and better and sharper so um, the gaffer and Sarge pulled me on um, yesterday and, and just said how, how do you think you would feel about being on the bench and, and me being me I was, <laughs> I was like in the candy shop so um, yeah I told them that I was, I was ready mentally and physically and uh, in my opinion and, and thankfully they they gave me that that we last I don't even know how long it was five ten minutes and it was just good to be back out there. Well, if being back on the bench was good, being on the pitch was even better. And what a fairy tale comeback when you took that free kick and smashed down the third goal. Yeah, well, I, I got my, I got my strip on and stuff, um, and and then the, the free kick was given and and, and Sergeant the gaffer were were well saying right do it now. Um, and as as Redder was walking off, the two of them were telling me to hit it. Uh, I think they had more confidence in, than I did in myself. Um, but when I got on and I seen the angle, and, and even Maz, Maz says go on, have a have a pop. So I just I'm just had it in my head, just hit the target, don't hit those heads. So um, no, thankfully it's, it's ended up in the, the top corner. Well, no doubt you feel fantastic emotionally, but how do you feel physically? Uh, physically, I, I feel really good. Um, my groin's really, really good. Obviously, I played the best part of a year before I was actually out with a lot of pain. And to be honest, it's nice to be able to run without pain. Um, so I, I feel a lot better than I actually did before the injury. Well, Declan, it's great to see you back on the pitch and what a fantastic strike as well today. Thank you, Rev. Cheers.